Hello, my name is Vsin. I'm just quickly posting this video for an update. Um, I've changed partnership from Zoom and TV to Union for Gamers, aka Curse. Honestly, I didn't need to bother with this video because there isn't much to say. I just changed partnership. Almost nothing about the channel is going to change. But I figured it would be better. I'd be better off mentioning it anyways. Anyways, game in the background is Fantasy Star Online 2 because hey, Curse MMOs. Online games, yay. Um, so, I, I guess for those of you who are, are maybe curious as to why I even bothered changing, um, it's no, it's not because of the 90-10 rev share. It's actually because of the one-month lock-in. Because someone like me, even though I'm, I've been getting into this partnership business and I've been like getting ad revenue and all that good stuff, I'm still not 100% comfortable with the way that I'm trying to take this channel. Like, okay, let me say this first of all. The, av like, the amount of money that I made from Zoom and TV 8020, it's going to be similar to what I get from Curse, was around 5 to 7 bucks per month. You know, at least with the channel at its current size. Which isn't, it's actually pretty damn decent, but when you weigh that against the cost of buying more games, that's completely overshadowed by a single game purchase of any type even on sale. I mean, I mean, it's technically even overshadowed by the price of PlayStation Plus, so needless to say, I'm anything but solvent with this channel, and <laughs> yeah, so that's the main reason why I'm mostly okay with ad revenue, even though I know that having ads at the start of the video are, is going to reject quite a few people and draw viewership, which is actually what I care more about right now. Um, but other than that, it's mostly just... I'm, I looked at Union for Gamers and thought to myself, hey, this is a network with a whole bunch of people that um, have large viewer bases, have people who pay attention to them. Um, in the time that I spent like, handling the situation, like for example, hey, I'm currently partnered to zoom in, can you wait until blah blah blah, uh, hey, my processing was this, that, and the other. Overall, like their support staff has been really good, they seem to have a pretty solid community of content developers. Um, and like zoom, like, I'm sorry, but with zoom in, it was just a case of, yes, they're there, yes, you can get support staff within about two days of, the, of, con of um, sending an email and something, but... Overall, that was a situation where, okay, I'm getting ad revu revenue, I stand a snowball's hand chance in hell of getting promoted. They're, they don't even really have a community of any description where you can talk to other content creators in the network. And overall, that, that felt like a complete and total dead end. Um, whereas this, like, I mean, if I sit on my ass and do absolutely nothing, is, is Curse going to do anything for me? Probably not. But I'm just thinking to myself, hey, you know what, these guys look like they have a reputation. Um, and overall it seems like I stand a chance of getting somewhere with them if I put work into it. If I talk to people, like, like it, I mean, this is a, again, this is a fairly large institution. They, for crying out loud, for some mysterious reason, they have three League of Legends teams and I have no idea why. And there are also quite a few successful YouTubers who are based off of it. I don't really want to say Athene, but Athene. Um, CivHD, I prefer mentioning over Sky. Um, there's also, I know there's one guy that I've been looking at Final Fantasy XIV videos for. He's with Curse as well. So they got a pretty good repertoire, although it's all online games. Hence, <laughs> Fantasy Star Online 2 in the background. Hey, I'm a part of the crew now. So overall, it's just TLDR. With you guys, nothing's going to change. It's just on my side, I think that this is a better opportunity then with Zoom and TV, I, I'll spend some time with them over the summer, see where it goes. Um, at the end of the day, I don't really, like, I mean, I, their contract is a wall of legalese, so I tried to go through it. It doesn't seem like there's anything bad in there, so hopefully, hopefully, this will be the realm of opportunity for my channel. And at worst, it'll be fine. So anyways, this is just a quick update. My name is Bean Vison. Thanks for watching.